Hey everyone, welcome back. Um, today I'm making a Bolivian Christmas dish. I don't know why, I just saw it on Instagram and it looks good, so that's what we're doing. So I've already browned um, chicken and beef and I took the chicken off. I'm adding in veggies I've already cut up during the week because I didn't have time to actually cook this during the week. So basically we have carrots, um, red onion, red bell pepper, and garlic. And I was also supposed to use parsnip but I could not find parsnip at the store and online it says you can kind of use carrot as a substitute of parsnip and there's already carrot in here. And then he did this super cool thing where he says he adds in um, some spices and I saw that he puts in cloves. He doesn't mention them by name. Um, and here's some bay leaves. He doesn't give any measurements for this dish either, so that's super fun. And then the actual spices he puts in, I'm not sure what they are, but I'm just gonna put in cumin because that's always good. And paprika. Okay, I am having a hard time opening up this wine bottle. I'm probably stupid, whatever. But we are covering it with water. And if I can get this freaking wine bottle open, that would be great. It looks like a twisty. I don't know. I, I don't know how to open wine. My God, I finally got it. And then you pour in some wine. Ooh. That's good. And I'm gonna let that simmer for, I guess like 20 minutes or so. Okay, yeah, so like I said, there's no like um, measurements or like specific timings for how long it's supposed to do anything. Just frustrating. But this is kind of the last step. Um, I'm adding in potatoes. And corn on the kib. Whoa, okay, there he goes. And putting the chicken back in. He didn't cut his up, so I'm hoping like this is also gonna kind of fall apart. And then add in some sugar. Woo! <laughs> so much sugar. Okay, <laughs> sure. Maybe I can get some of it out. That's better. Okay, and then I will let that simmer covered this time and then it will be done. Shoot, I totally forgot the first time after I added in the red, uh, I needed to add in uh, peas and raisins. Yeah, I don't know about this whole raisin business, but whatever. Don't know what they're doing in Bolivia. Alright, I think I am gonna call it. Here is our soup. Oh, that's really good. Not sure how practical this corn on the cob is. <laughs> I guess I'll eat that last. Mmm. Beef is so good. And the chicken did end up falling apart, so that is super awesome. Here's some raisins. This actually kind of works. It's a little sweetness. But yeah, this is very good. Some wine for me as well. Thank y'all so much for watching and I will see you next time.